hello welcome to avoid tv thank you for stopping by my channel to watch my videos if you're new to my channel please hit the subscribe button so that you'll be alerted whenever i drop a new video but if you've been coming here and you have never subscribed please hit the subscribe button all you have to do is sign in on youtube while you're watching this video right now uh, with your gmail login information your uh, gmail username and password and then you click on subscribe so that you can officially be part of the avoid tv family thank you so much for doing this Today, I wanted to talk to you all about the COVID-19 test requirement. This is something new. This will be effect or was effect just last uh, few, few days ago, December 6th. And so starting from December 6th, anybody who is two years or older, uh, regardless of their immigration status, whether they're a U.S. citizen, Greek card holder, whatever, new immigrant coming to the United States will need to get COVID-19 test a uh, uh, negative COVID-19 test uh, a day before departure to the United States. So that means that if you are uh, you plan on going to the United States or you are leaving for the United States, you get your COVID-19 test. It shouldn't be more than one day, okay? And if your flight is connecting to other countries, like going to Europe or Middle East, wherever it's going through, make sure that it doesn't get to uh, one day before you get to America. You have to be very careful. So it's not just uh, uh, one day before you getting on the flight. But let's say you are connecting in London or connecting in uh, Turkey somewhere and you stay there longer. Like your connecting flight or your layover is long. And then by the time you get to the U.S. it's over. Um, it's going to be over uh, one day. You'll be forced to do another COVID test in your uh, connecting uh, airport. Okay. So keep that in mind and get your COVID test done. Uh, if you have recently been tested positive for COVID-19, then you need to, uh, you are exempt from doing this COVID test. But instead, you need to bring proof or documentation of your uh, um, positive COVID test and a letter from a health uh, professional. So probably like the hospital that you were, you know, tested for the COVID and for the person to write a statement that you are cleared to travel. Okay. So if you have recently recovered from COVID-19, then please go back to that hospital that you were admitted on the hospital that cleared you that you are, you have recovered. Let them give you a statement. Let the doctor give you a statement that says that you are clear to, uh, to travel, okay? And that should be good for your documentation. But in rare situations, you may need some kind of documentation. But this is all for, you know, the general things that you can ask for, right? So thank you so much. This is all that I wanted to share with you guys. Uh, please don't make this mistake because you will miss your flight. If you don't do it, if you play ignorant, you're going to miss your flight. So guys, I love you so much. I miss y'all. I'm glad I'm going to be back in America pretty soon. Uh, I'm still in Ghana, but I'll be back in America pretty soon so that we can do more live videos and all the stuff that I'm excited to share with you about my trip to Ghana here. Please subscribe, subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to hit the 5K, 5K, okay? We have some days to go to the end of the year. So guys, please subscribe, share my videos with at least five of your friends, at least, okay? And guys, uh, you can join my Facebook group, Wafoy TV. Uh, uh, Wafoy TV is the official Facebook page. You just click thumbs up and you follow my page. We don't charge you anything. And you can join my Greek Alori group, Greek Alori Africa, Greek Alori Ghana. It doesn't matter where you come from, whether you are even an African or not. You can join any of the groups. Just be respectful. We talk about just immigration. Anything other than that, you, sh you shouldn't post that in the group. But be respectful. If you want to be added to my Greek uh, Lori groups on WhatsApp, that is just for winners only. People who have already been selected for the Greek Lotto. And I'm talking about those in DV 2022 or some of the DV 2021 who didn't get interviews. But, you know, are hopeful because of the, the, the judgment, uh, the court order. You can join my uh, WhatsApp group, but I need to see proof. I need to see that you won. You were selected. You are the actual person who was selected for this uh, lottery. So, guys, I'm sweating like a fish because, I mean, this guy, I don't want so much outside noise. But thank you so much for sticking around and watching my videos. I love you, and I'll see you on my next video. Bye-bye.